Hello all, welcome to Autobot YouTube channel. So today we are going to see how to resolve this particular uh, error like uh, sign in or enable troubleshooting session from orchestrator for debugging purposes. Okay, so this is actually not an error. So this is just a message for you to enable the debugging in the orchestrator. Okay, so in this machine I have configured unattended robot uh, uh, in my uh, uh, system okay so I have conf configured unattended robot in my uh, system so uh, for the unattended execution what I have to do I have to give the uh, credentials to uh, enable or to login to the particular system right I suppose if I schedule something in the unattended board it has to execute that in my particular machine even though it is in a lock state right for that we have to give the credentials so in order to enable the debugging like uh, suppose a developer need to uh, test something or debug some process which is configured in orchestrator without going to the uh, orchestrator and executing that particular operation what he can do if he enable the debugging mode he can see all the process in the UI path assistant itself okay so it will save the time to log into the particular account and uh, it will help the developers to get all the process to the UiPath assistant and they can uh, directly execute that in using the UiPath assistant okay so let us see what is this particular uh, notification for that I have uh, opened a documentation uh, that is provided by uh, the UiPath so docs.uipath.com orchestrator and this is for uh, this is some uh, release note that has released in August 2021 okay so say goodbye to the hassle of debugging when the enforce user authentication or disable robot key authentication option is enabled okay so also known as uh, interactive login set from tenant setting in orchestrator so this is nothing but like uh, if we have enabled this particular condition like uh, based on the use service username and password if if uh, the robot like the unattended robot have to execute something in our machine then it is called the enforcer uh, user authentication okay so while this feature brings multiple advantages like a security enhancement easier flow for attended users when connecting to orchestrator streamlined uh, licensing for users by enabling the user license management functionality okay so these are the benefits of configuring these robots in this uh, manner but what are the uh, difficulties it also had a side effect a more uh, cumbersome uh, debugging experience for the unattended process okay so when logging into machine connected to orchestrator via machine key for debugging purpose while interactive authentication is enforced there are no process available in your assistant to debug them unless you first sign in okay so if you want to get uh, the process in your uipath uh, assistant what you'll have to do you will have to enable or you will have to sign in to the particular orchestrator account okay connected to orchestrator via machine for debugging purpose by interactive authentication first there are no process available in your assistant to debug them unless you first sign in okay so if you want to get those process you will have to sign in to the particular account right but uh, it may be like for a developer it may be difficult uh, or uh, he may be not authorized to uh, log into that particular uh, session of the user to view what are the process configured right for that what is the other possibility for that uh, now you can achieve this by enabling a trouble uh, shooting session on the machine which is available from the unattended session tab of the robot page okay so if you want to debug something in uh, a machine what we can do we can enable the debugging okay or enable debugging for some span of time and during that time the developers can uh, test out the uh, process that is configured okay so i will show you how what what you can do so currently if you check here you can see use interactive login okay so use interactive login to uh, uh, connect to the orchestrator and uh, here when i go to the studio here it is showing like a robot error okay so communication error with robot service please check a robot service uh, uh, status okay but here uh, you can see it is connected to the orchestrator but there is some uh, robot error so i will show you how you can resolve this error okay 
for doing that what you have to do is go to your orchestrator okay uh, click on orchestrator go to tenant okay inside that if you have configured the unattended robot in your machine just go to unattended session okay here you can see the troubleshooting is in a disabled mode all right so we have to enable it then only uh, we can see all the process inside the uipath assistant okay so currently we are not able to see any process that is configured in the orchestrator so i'm going to enable this uh, troubleshooting session okay so i'm just going to troubleshoot it so what is the maximum time that we can give so the maximum time is 2160 minutes okay we can provide so let me give it 2160 you can give any time okay so up to this time uh, the developer will be able to uh, see all the process in the orchestrator okay so i'm going to save this Okay, so now this is enabled. So let me go to the path assistant. Okay, so now you can see it is uh, connected fine. So robot is connected to the orchestrator. Okay, so now now it is in green color and robot is connected to the orchestrator. And you can and uh, see the process also, right? And you can see the process also. And if you want to debug something, you can directly execute that from the UiPath assistant instead of going to the orchestrator, right? So that is the purpose of uh, this uh, enable uh, debugging. And here, if you go to the uh, UiPath Studio, still you can see that is a robot error. Robot error is there. So what I'm going to do is just click on this button and click on refresh. Okay, so it will refresh the connection again to the orchestrator. Okay, so this is the process that uh, I executed from the UiPath assistant. Okay, so that process is completed. And here you can see our uh, robot is now uh, connected. Right, it is uh, directly connecting to the folder that we have created in the orchestrator and it is showing all the uh, folders right it is showing all the folders that is configured in the orchestrator right so this is what you have to do if you are getting that a particular notification in the ui path assistant okay so to uh, uh, enable the session what you have to do is you have to go to tenant then uh, go to the unattended uh, session and just enable this uh, troubleshooting okay so for that particular time that you're going to give till that time your assistant will get to connect to the orchestrator for the debugging purpose okay so hope this video is useful uh, please share this video to your friends and please give your valuable comments and don't forget to subscribe our channel so thanks for watching the video bye